M0FXB Hamtech, welcome to my channel. Playing around with my RTL SDR dongle that you can see there, version 4. Adding this plugin called Fast Scanner. The system is you go to your RTL SDR folder. You can see it there on the left, just here. Download the plugin as well, which is just here. Just click that, and that will download to your downloads folder. You'll see it there, then double click that and extract it somewhere where you're going to find it. You can see it's called Frequency Scanner. Just extract it to and then find a folder where you'll remember where it is. I've got one here called Plugin. I'll just extract it there so I know where it is. Then I go to that folder called Frequency Scanner. We'll double click it. I've got two choices here, Net 3.5, and I've actually tried these both. But we'll try the top one. These are the DAL files and what they call the magic line. We'll drag the DLL file across to it, like so. So that's in our SDR. It says it's already there because I've been playing around with this for a while. Then we'll look for the word plugins here. Scroll down until you see plugins here, like so. There's plugin there. So we'll right click and we're going to click edit notepad and I've already added the commands that I want several times here these are plugins so what you do you go to magic line here that's left in that frequency scanner file this is what it looks like you copy it okay copy like so then go to your that plugins folder which is let's find it again And then you paste the command here, and I've literally done it like five times, okay? You just go, just go add. I, and I've tried to do it above the word plugins. I've tried to do it below the word plugins. I've tried everything here. You can see here, look, yeah? Sharp plugins. I go to the end. And I go like so. I'll delete the old one, actually. There's the old one I just did. Delete, and I just... Go to the end of the forward arrow, paste. Then I go file, save. Okay, so it's saved, it's all in there. So in theory, that should now work. So if I now open up my SDR, double click that, you would think it would just appear. My dongle's plugged in, it works fine. Just press play. Four, three, four, five, five, oh, that's my node. And let's go to plugins. Now, this is where I'm looking. I'm looking here and no, and I've checked it before and after and no plugin appears. So someone who's, who knows how to solve this, please let me know. Because as far as I can see, that's the correct process and I've done it in the past and it's worked. So why is it not working now? Unless it could just be that plugin. Yeah, that, that's my working well. I mean, let's just for fun while we're there, just try another plugin. So we'll go to that list of different plugins. You just do a search here. Well, there they are, they're on the right. So let's look at that one there. That's what's that? QPSK demodulator. Let's just add that. Okay. We know the process. Got that in my downloads folder. So we'll go to my downloads. Oh, it's called Meteor. Cool. And there's everything we need. So what I'm going to do, not sure about the license thing, but let's just see if we can get the plugin to add. So I'm going to cop copy these two and drag them into my... Let's just do one line at a time. Actually, I'll just drag them across. Let's go into my RTO SDR. Drag them across in one, press any key. Drag this one as well, two. Hopefully they're both in there. Magic line. Add that. Copy. Go into the plugins. 
Oh, pre press the wrong one. You've got to right click, edit, go underneath, paste, and then save. That's quite key that you save. We're going to go file, save. Close all that down. Then fire up my dongle again. So I just close it. For now, I could try reboot. I suppose I haven't really tried that. But anyway, first of all, we'll fire it up again. See if that one appears. So I think I've got the system right of adding and I've done it in the past. It was about a year ago. And if you look, I don't see any meteor, do you? So I'm obviously missing a step. I know that if I go start and go to my PC, let's go here, start, let's close down the SDR, PC, go into my main drive, and you'll see that I've got plugins and all kinds of stuff here as well. Should I be putting it there? Go right click. Um, edit. Now, it's not there, you know. So I could just try, put them both here, enter. The thing is when I save, it, it doesn't, I feel like it doesn't allow me to save, but we'll still try it. So we'll do the other plug-in as well while we're at it. So, you know, remember my channel's about me learning in front of you. And when I try and do it, it just goes to error. So I'm, I must be doing something wrong. Please someone help me. Bye for now, 7-3.